What's up guys, it's Caliber here. So I got a new flashlight. Um, so this is what it is. It's the Husky 1000 lumen LED aluminum flashlight. Uh, it has a lifetime warranty. It says virtually unbreakable. I don't know how true that is. I'm not gonna test that. Uh, let's see, FL1 standards, 1000 lumens, runtime 13 hours and a distance of 310 meters. Uh, nine meters, I guess, drop, and apparently it you can submerge it up to one meter. Not going to test that either, even though I have the uh, the fucking coast that that I've submerged before. But I'm not going to submerge this one. And that's that's pretty much it. So now the reason why I have this flashlight is because my grandfather has one that he used for work, and he was let me play around with it. So. I've, gotten pretty familiar with this flashlight but I liked it so much he actually went out and got me one and um takes get off get this off also look at the threading on this I don't know how well you're going to be able to see that but the fucking threading is ridiculous um take C cells it's a it's a big flashlight um for comparison, I have my uh, my Bushnell stays down here, but you can kind of see the fucking size difference. Um, but this is a hefty flashlight. It's really fucking bright. So yeah, uh, got rubber around the uh, flashlight head right here. I don't know if that's really the right thing to call it. It also has um, rubber on the tail cap. It's knurled, so it's got all these little knurlings and. Um, yeah, it's a pretty cool flashlight. Triple LEDs, 1,000 lumens like the packaging said. But uh, enough of showing it this. Let's take it outside. All right, so we're outside. Um, I have my work light set up out here because I needed light to put my tripod together and everything. But uh, let's go ahead and get on with it. So as you can see, this light's decently bright. And, um, uh, actually, okay, it was on high. All right, but as you can see, this light is decently bright. But the one thing about this, because it has the triple LEDs, it's got a very, very wide beam. And that's one of the reasons why my grandfather likes this flashlight so much. Same reason why I like it. Because, yeah, I have flashlights that have a telescoping lens where you can have either a flood beam or a spot beam. But to have one, um, a flashlight that's specifically designed for like a flood, flood or, or actually it's kind of good for both really. So yeah, but, um, but this has got a white, nice wide beam on it and it works really, really well. It's a little pain in the ass to carry because it's so heavy, but, um, other than that, I mean, you get past the weight and shit and the sheer size of it. It's not a bad flashlight to use. Um, definitely good if you're exploring ban abandoned buildings or in a cave system or something like that. So yeah, but uh, that's pretty much it. Anyways guys, if you enjoyed the video, leave a like down below. Don't forget to comment, share, and subscribe. Don't forget to hit that notification bell to be alerted when I upload new videos. Anyways guys, this is Caliber signing out.